Hello everyone, welcome to this new video by Chez Mami where the French cuisine is made easy. So today uh, we are going to make some mashed potatoes or purée in French, which is a very popular and easy uh, recipe. Indeed, uh, we can have a purée with a beef, with a chicken, with a beef stew or bœuf bourguignon in French, uh, for example. And I will use this uh, recipe in one of the next uh, videos uh, to make a hachis parmentier, so stay tuned. But for now, let's focus on this easy purée or mashed potatoes. So for a perfect uh, homemade puree, you will need some potatoes, obviously. So here you have 700 grams of potatoes. Then you will need 15 centiliters of milk here. Then 20 grams of butter. And just because I like it, some grated cheese. So here like a 40 grams of emmental, but you could have some uh, Conte, for example, uh, that has a stronger uh, flavor. So depending on your liking here, that's emmental uh, only. So not very strong. And then one uh, egg yolk because I like it as well. So to make it a little bit more uh, yellow for the mashed potatoes or for the puree. And then finally some uh, nutmeg, salt and pepper. So are you ready? Let's start. First, you wash your potatoes and you boil them. So two tips uh, here. Number one, you cut them before uh, boiling so that uh, it takes less time uh, for the potatoes to, to boil. And number two, don't peel them off uh, at the beginning. Uh, otherwise, they will get a little bit uh, uh, soggy. So just peel them off after uh, they are boiled. So once you have your potatoes, you can add your milk here just a little bit and then you can start mashing a little bit the potatoes. Don't use a mixer, just do it manually. First, that's a uh, much more fun even when you have some kids for example that's more fun and also the mixer would uh, would make it too uh, too liquid to my taste so that's better like uh, just mash with um, let's say uh, a fork uh, here so that's a little bit better and then you can add the milk uh, to make the, the process the process uh, easier don't put all the milk in one shot otherwise as you can see, there will be some projection. Uh, you can even leave some bigger uh, chunks if you want. That's what I like as well. So that that would show that's a really like a homemade and not industrial uh, puree because industrial puree that would be made of uh, high dehydrated uh, powder and uh, you wouldn't find those big chunks of potatoes. So that's usually a, a nice idea to leave some chunks of potatoes. Then you can also add your egg uh, yolk. As you can see, that makes the puree a little bit more yellow. And then you can add your butter as well. Just a tip uh, here, the, the butter you could uh, you could take it out of the fridge for one hour or so, so that uh, even though that's not melted, but at least that's a little bit uh, softer uh, to to mash as well and to incorporate into the uh, the puree. Then this is the last big chunk. So as you can see, that's a very again. Very easy uh, recipe here that we that we have, and that's why you are here because you want to get French cuisine and easy recipe. So you can also you can also have add some grated uh, cheese to make it nicer. 
Again, if you like more flavor, you could choose for uh, uh, Conte, for example, that has stronger flavor than uh, Emmental. You could choose Gruyere as well, like a Swiss or French, that depends on your belief and country of origin, I would say. Then you can also leave a big chunk of grated cheese as well. And we are almost ready. So now you can add some nutmeg, a little bit. Some salt. And also, depending on your liking again, you may want to add some extra milk depending on the texture that you want to have for your puree. So I'm just adding here the remaining of the milk. But as you can see with a 15 centiliters and 700 grams of potatoes, you have this kind of puree. The last, very last step would be to heat up the puree. First to make it warm for your guests and for your uh, dish and also to cook the egg yolk a little bit. So don't forget to heat up the puree and that will be a very nice homemade and easy puree. Et voilà, et voilà, congratulations, you made your mashed uh, potatoes or puree uh, in French. Some extra tips uh, here, so just for decoration, I added some uh, parsley, uh, and also you can have that, your puree with uh, some cured uh, ham if you want. An extra tip is that also you can put your puree in the, in the freezer and then heat it up uh, when you need uh, in the microwave, uh, no, no issue uh, here. So if you like the, the video, don't forget to subscribe and to like the video. You will find more uh, recipes by Chez Mamie where the French cuisine is made easy.